Alright, I'm doing uh, reloading some 223 to go shoot some pigs here pretty soon. And I um, just figured I'd bring you guys along for the ride. I'm going to try a bullet that I haven't used before. We're going with the uh, Nosler Ballistics Tip Varmint Bullet. Which they don't, they don't recommend as much for larger game. And the reason why is because it's got a really thin uh, jacket. Uh, on the bullet so it expands really quickly it doesn't have as good a penetration coyotes rabbits uh, animals with thin skin the bullet starts to expand really quickly and that's when you kind of get that pop or the ex you know the exploding bullets when you shoot varmints um, the really thin copper jacket is pretty much what does that so on a larger bullet or even the same size grain bullet but one maybe for hunting larger game, you might have a bonded core, bonded lead core, um, or something like that, where the bullet would penetrate more before it starts to expand. Uh, so this one doesn't uh, fragment as much, so I think it'll be uh, a good medium. Uh, so what I'm doing here is uh, loading up 30 rounds, and I'm just going to try a couple different powder ranges to really dial in and see where I'm at. The gun that I'm going to shoot is uh, a 16 inch AR-15, one and nine twist barrel, um, hence why I'm using 55 grain, it shoots those really, really well. Uh, my basic like bulk reloads, full metal jacket, um, they're one in a So um, the rifle is capable of doing what I need it to do, I just need to see what load's gonna work good. So here's just uh, you know, a look at what I'm working with here. I'm going to go ahead and load up the rest of these, and then we'll uh, go take it to the range. I'll show you a close-up of one of the rounds here. Here we go. The lighting is not the best, but you can see it. So, uh, just some stats for you guys. Uh, the load that I think is going to work the best is probably going to be um, 25 grains. I'm using uh, Hodgdon H335 powder and um, trim my cases to 1.745. And the overall length is 2.228. That's just kind of my favorite recipe that I like to use for these things. So, see how they do.